Um, hello all, I am Dr. Jayanti from Roshni Counseling Center and I am going to talk today uh, about resilience uh, in human beings, especially uh, during tough times such as COVID. Uh, also, uh, this video is a part of uh, our ongoing World Men Mental Health Day Awareness Program. So what is resilience? Resilience is nothing, it's not a very big uh, medical term or anything. It is something which says that you need to bounce back, regroup yourself and be yourself even in tough times and be on top of the game no matter what challenges come into your life. So how how is one uh, going to be resilient? Um, usually there are people who are born with resilience and there are some who develop it over the years also. So basically if you see, in an equation of an event, a response and outcome. So an event is something which we don't have a control over like the COVID uh, event, we don't have a control over but we can choose how to respond to the event, we can respond to it positively, then we are resilient. So we, as, as if as we see uh, that there are several challenges thrown our way now because of the covid and also due to the you know close down of colleges and schools parents are struggling uh, workplace issues are there so how do we stay resilient how do we stay in balance so as i have seen uh, a lot of cases in which i have taught people to be resilient they have helped themselves with the four m's of mental health what are these four health M's of mental health. One is movement. It is very important to be physically fit. I'm not saying that we need to have a you know beautiful figure or uh, you know look good. Of course, it's important to look good, but we need to develop our stamina. So that is why movement is very important. Second is mastery. You utilize this time to learn something new which you have always wanted to do, be it a craft or be it a technology be it language, be it music, dance, anything which you have wanted to learn, you didn't have time for it, utilize this time for it. That is mastery. Third M is to have uh, meaningful conversations, meaningful social relationships. Get on a Zoom call, have a tea party, virtual world is at your feet now. And the fourth most important thing to be resilient is to learn mindfulness. And that is being in the present being in here and now. There are so many things which are not in our control. There are so many things which we uh, cannot help ourselves be upset about. But constantly worrying about it or constantly thinking back like I could have done this or I could have done that is not going to help. So be mindful. Be in the present. Mindfulness practices are beautiful. They date back to so many years and it is Indian in origin. But uh, as we don't practice it, we are losing track of the beautiful experience of being mindful. Eat mindfully, speak mindfully and be in the present and that is how you can be resilient and bounce back into being yourself without losing yourself in this pandemic or in any of the mental health issues. So all the best, take care, stay in, stay safe.